Without the test, there is no testimony. I heard this about a year ago, and I thought, that is fantastic. That is a fantastic way to couch a universal truth, truth of success, which is that in order for you to accomplish more, in order for you to have more, in order for you to, to begin to experience things you've never experienced before, you're going to have to go through some things you've never gone through before. You're going to have to learn some things you didn't know before. You're going to have to do some things that you either couldn't do or were unwilling to do before. Because you see, everything that you've done up to this point, your habitual way of thinking, the actions that you take, the decisions that you make, that's what's gotten you where you are. So if you want to achieve more, you have to be willing to do something different, think differently, act differently, behave differently, make different decisions than you've ever made before. And with that is going to come a challenge because it's hard. Anytime you're doing something for the first time or something that you're not accustomed to doing or have never done before, it's difficult. It's a challenge. And so with that test comes the testimony. I love that phrase, right? You've also heard it said, is the juice worth the squeeze, right? Where do these phrases come from? Here's where it comes from. Ultimately, success and reward comes with risk and with challenge. Every opportunity comes wrapped in a problem. This has been a universal truth forever. And if you think about it, most of the time your breakthroughs are just on the other side of some sort of breakdown. And it's your decision making now that is the key. You see, some people when they really begin to get squeezed, when things really begin to become tight, when things really begin to become hard, when the pressure becomes put on, when things begin to seem overwhelming, some folks just give up and give in. And that's okay. That's okay. But you see, when you give up and you give in, it may alleviate some of the pressure, but it doesn't alleviate it all. And here's what else it does. It prevents the breakthrough from happening. Look, they call it a breakthrough for a reason. It's because it's like hitting a wall and you just get to push, 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 push until you break through. And a breakthrough is always on the other side of a breakdown of some kind. So that's your choice when you reach that point is to decide. Do I continue? Do I press? Do I push forward? Or do I pull back? But know that if you continue to push, you continue to press, that a breakthrough is imminent. And if you look back along your life, you'll see several points in your life where you've had some sort of breakthrough and the payoff is tremendous. So here's what you need to know. If you're going through some challenges right now, good. It means you're growing. It means that you're about to have a breakthrough. It means that if you continue the course, if you stay the course, you're going to be rewarded. Remember, the greater the challenge, the greater the reward. The greater the risk, the greater the payoff. And it doesn't mean you'll never lose. And it doesn't mean that risks won't ever turn out not the way you hoped. But do you understand that in order for you to change some things in your life, if you desire change, not some of us don't, but if you do, it's going to require you to make some challenging decisions and changes and get uncomfortable and do all those things and just be okay with it. But remember, the greater the challenge, the greater the reward. The greater the risk, the greater the reward. And the more uncomfortable you feel, the more it means you're growing, you're doing things you've never done, which means you're going to experience greater results and greater rewards than you've ever had. So get excited about that. Get excited that with the test comes the testimony. Embrace the challenges. Embrace the struggle. Embrace being uncomfortable and run with it. And with that, guys, make it a great day.